guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here please make sure you hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video also I've noticed a lot of my viewers especially my most recent videos are not people that are subscribed so I really really hope that today is a day that you can subscribe and help support my channel and follow me along on this journey of home stuff, uh, vlogs, um, puppy content um, and just anything lifestyle if that's what you're interested in so I really really appreciate any support that you can give um, but enough of that I am so happy to finally have my camera back hello Rambo um, finally have my camera back and be filming with my Sony camera because it's been a long time since I haven't been able to film with it um, it's been probably since November time. Remember, what are you doing in my hair? It's been since November time that I haven't been able to use my camera and I've been using my phone because obviously I still love filming um, and I thought I didn't want to sort of not film. But I'm so glad to have my camera back and I hope you guys can notice the difference in quality and I hope you can appreciate the quality and yeah. Enough of that, just what I would mention that I got my camera right because I'm super happy about that. But today's video is actually an updated morning routine with a puppy. So for those of you that have followed me sort of since I started my channel last year, or even if you have watched this video, I did a productive morning routine, uh, just sort of some of the stuff that I've done um, during my mornings when I wasn't working, when it was locked down. I mean, we're still in lockdown. But it's changed slightly because now I'm working and I have a little puppy so it's really hard to try and get a lot of things done in such a short space of time because really I don't have any time. But I thought I would sort of give you a realistic update of what it is like trying to get, you know, things clean, trying to, you know, get yourself ready and get yourself together whilst you're also trying to look after this little, little, little puppy. Yeah, hello to the vlog, Rambo. This is Rambo, for those of you who don't know. This is my little puppy. He's a five month, almost six month old Yorkie. So we think, we think he might be mixed. So if you see my other videos, you'll know what I mean. But he's the cutest little boy. His name's Rambo. Yeah, he definitely has the Rambo personality. Um, and he's so sweet. And you'll be seeing him a lot more in my videos. Hey Rambo, time to subscribe them to subscribe to your channel baby yeah <laughs> um, but you know you'll see what it's really like because I didn't want to just do a sort of oh this is my morning routine I wanted to really showcase what it's like you know having a puppy especially one that's five months old and trying to get stuff done as you can see I'm trying to film and he's just not letting me film he's just biting my sleeves biting my hand so it has been difficult so I wanted to really show you what it's like especially for those considering getting a puppy or who have a puppy or have a dog you know and really like not sugarcoat anything or not hide anything of what it's actually like but also I want to sort of go through an updated like skincare that I use um, just typical stuff that I do um, because it's updated since the last video that I did um, on sort of my top favourite products but yeah that's pretty much it for today so stay tuned and I'll see you guys in the next clip but as you know it's always 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 first tea not coffee first tea before we get anything done so Rambo are you ready to do a little morning routine yeah he's ready <laughs> so I'll catch you guys in a bit Mwah! Now that we've got our tea and we're ready to start the morning, hopefully, because I'm not been getting sort of any sleep whatsoever um, with him crying, with my husband getting up really early to go to work and then me working, not been getting any sleep, so I always need at least a tea or coffee before I can get anything done. Now what we're going to do is give Rambo his little morning treats. 
he gets so excited for these morning treats. We give him like a dental like stick and sometimes we give him just a little biscuits um, and then we give him just a couple of other treats and then he has his breakfast and obviously water and stuff like that. So I'll show you the products that I use um, for his sort of treats, his favourite ones. So I'll show you that and that's pretty much what I do next. So I'll show you that now. Um, so what I do is I start with the Healthy Treats Vet IQ Breath and Dental. So they're these ones. Um, these are really good because they help keep his teeth clean. I give it one in the morning and one at night and it's for dogs um, or puppies rather from four weeks and over. So that's really good. Um, and then, so when I show you these treats, it's not, I don't give them all at once, but I'm just kind of giving you which ones I mix and match daily and in the morning. Sometimes I'll go in with the pedigree test, tasty treats, cheese and beef flavor nibbles. So they're these ones. So these are really good as well. Um, so you can, I think you can give up to six. Uh, depend, it depends on the size. So it tells you sort of what size and how much you can give your dog. And it's good because it's got stuff like vitamin E, calcium, stuff like that for your puppy. Then I like giving him these mini dental chewy sticks. So these are good for small breeds. Uh, so I just give one a day because he literally takes all day just to chew on one. These are good just to clean his teeth as well. Um, anytime you can't brush it or, you know, if he doesn't let you brush it, like our puppy. So I really recommend something like these dental sticks. Um, so these ones I don't give in the morning, but I thought I'd show you anyway. These are baked treats that we give at night before bed and it helps him sleep and relax. And they have chamomile in, uh, and he really loves chamomile just like his mama. And um, so I'll show you these, these are really good as well. Uh, we just give him one. Um, you can, or sometimes two, you can give him, it depends, it tells you at the back the size guy, so it just depends on the size of your dog and stuff like that. Then these are the OG ones, that this OG brand that we got him even when we first got him, and it's the Wag Treats. But we just literally introduced him to this flavour and it is peanut butter and banana which he loves and they're cookie bites and it's for puppies age 8 weeks and over so that's really good. Um, then another one from the same brand which is the Wag Low Fat Turkey and Rice which he also likes. We thought we'd incorporate low fat especially when training because he's so small we don't want to overfeed him when we're trying to train him. And Yorkies are very, very, very hard to train. So we don't want to give him too many treats um, when training him. So we thought let's get one that uh, low fat and also has you know added like vitamins and minerals and stuff like that. And for eight weeks and over as well. And last but not least, there's still some more, but I won't go through all of them and bore you. Um, are these ones that my husband got? They're the puppy milk drops. They're, they look like literally like um, little buttons. Like white, they look like white chocolate buttons, but they're made from milk. And I don't know if he likes them yet because we, I think we gave him one and he didn't seem to want anything to do with it. He was literally playing with it for ages, but he's like that. It takes him a while to get used to um, sort of different treats. So he'll play with it for about half an hour before he actually wants to try it out. And as we speak, he is being so cute. I'll show you. Come here, everybody. Come here, baby. Oh, you're waiting for your snacks. He's literally waiting for all his snacks. My little baby is waiting for all his snacks. Remember? Yeah, he wants his snacks. So I'm going to give him his morning stuff, then he's going to eat, and then we'll move on to the next morning routine. Remember, you ready for your treat? Sit. Sit. Good boy. Ready? Sit. Good. Oh, you are sitting. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> and now we're going to give you your dental treat, which we know you like. Yeah, you're still chewing. You're still chewing, Rambo. There you go. There you go. So now that I've had my tea, he's had his treats. Um, he's already had some of his breakfast. He sort of goes back and forth with having his breakfast. He doesn't literally just sit there, eat his food and then go. He will go back and forth and 
just keep going running around playing and eating. So what I like to do now is just play with him for a little bit, um, just get him all, you know, happy and energized and sort of ready for the day. Um, and also gives me a bit of exercise, literally running back and forth with him. So that's what I like. So yeah, we're gonna quickly play for a bit and I'm gonna do some like stuff around here, like tidying up, um, doing the bed, still haven't done the bed. Um, usually I would fit makeup in there somewhere if I'm wearing makeup, I haven't worn makeup in about two weeks until now. But, because I've already done it, I won't show that bit, but yeah. So let's go and play with Rambo. <laughs> So I'm in my bathroom now, so I've literally spent a long time playing with Rambo. I didn't want to film it all just because it would just be the same stuff of me running around like a weirdo trying to chase my puppy whilst he plays. Um, so I'm in an hour ensuite bathroom now. Um, looks exactly like our main bigger bathroom, but it's just a little bit smaller. So sorry if there's an echo in here. Because I noticed when I filmed in my bathroom last time there was an echo, but because I'm using the camera, I'm hoping there isn't. So I wanted to show you some of my skincare that I did this morning and that I do every morning because I've already done it, so I'm not going to show it, but I'll show you the products that I use. One of them is Simple De Stress Mask, Sheet Mask. I love this um, sheet mask, um, it's just really nice. There's no perfume, which is what I love. I'm trying to cut out perfume out all of my skincare products because I have sensitive skin, I have sensitive and dry skin so I'm trying to cut out perfume of everything and hopefully notice a little bit of a difference but I love this one, I've always used simple products especially stuff like sheet masks um, and stuff like that so I love this one. I use the Garnier Micellar Water which I love using just as like a second little cleanser uh, to remove my makeup. When I don't wear makeup I only use my main cleanser but that's it. Um, I used to use the uh, Body Shop, I think it was the Chamomile one, but um, I decided, I ran out, so I decided to try a new one. Don't judge the ball, but I used the Oat Cleansing Balm from the Inky List. So thank you Hiram for recommending the Inky List. <laughs> um, but I really like this. I wanted to try their products because I know they don't use fragrance and stuff and this has been really really good on my skin i've actually been using it for maybe a couple weeks now and it's really good and i use this as a first cleanser so try the inky list out if you haven't because they're really affordable but they're really good products and i use the inky list again um hyaluronic acid serum as just something i put on um, morning and evening before my moisturiser so I love doing that and like I said I've got dry skin so it really really helps with my dry skin then I don't use this at morning but I thought I'd show you anyway I use it in the evening and it's the ordinary 100% organic cold press rose hip seed oil um, so I use that um, and it's almost like nearly finished um, I love rose hip, I love rose hip tea, so I thought I'd try it out in oil and it's really good um, and hydrating for since I was using, I'm still currently using it because I don't want to chuck it away, but the um, Mario Badescu, however you say it, um, cream for dry skin. Um, it has fragrance in it, so that's why I want to stop using it. I mean, it's a really good thick cream, I'll show you. Really good thick cream but it's got fragrance in, so I don't want to use anything with fragrance anymore for my sensitive skin, so I'm trying to change my products. I did actually buy, and I'll show you, um, 
the inky list moisturizer it's the snow mushroom um i bought this and i really like it but i also want to incorporate the hemp moisturizer just because i have my skin's really dry and i feel like with this being a gel based one it just sort of soaks it up too quickly and my skin st still feels a little bit dry but this is really good for just dehydrated skin i guess so i kind of want to use this on top of another moisturizer or mix them or maybe use this in the morning as a light moisturizer and then get the hemp one in the evening um as part of my evening skincare routine as a thicker one main products that i've been using um oh i forgot to also show this is you've seen this in my last video paula choice calm bha lotion exfoliant for all skin types it's just like an exfoliator um i don't use this all the time but i do like to use it some of the time um but yeah well, I'll give you a quick little update on my morning skincare routine. Probably stuff I'm forgetting, but I don't want to make this about a skincare video, which it's not. So, um, if you want, I can link all these products below and you can check them out. And yeah, so next, we're going to move on to making the bed. And that's pretty much my quick morning routine. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. So I know I said I was going to do make the bed next, which I, I already did off camera purely because I'm not using our big tripod, I'm using our little handheld um, vlog tripod and I didn't have anywhere to put um, the tripod when making my bed. So instead what I'm going to do is, which we tend to do quite often anyway, we usually do it in the evenings but I'll do it in the morning. Uh, is brushing Rambo because his coat needs to be brushed every day because it gets really really knotted um, so I'm going to do that and then that pretty much covers our typical morning routine um, sometimes on a good day he's really calm like he's been alright today um, so every time I film I've noticed he's really good but then other days he drives me crazy I think it's mostly when I'm working and not able to give him attention but yeah so I'm going to give him a quick brush and I'll show you guys how I do it and the brush I use and that'll be pretty much our morning routine. So the brush that I tend to use for brushing him is just this one. It's just a standard like brush that I like to use. Sorry, we've got builders still here, so they're being really loud. Um, so I tend to use this when brushing him. And sometimes I go in with this spray. It's like a daily spray you can use. It's like a refreshing body mist that you can just use daily when obviously you're not giving him baths and stuff. And it's rose and lemongrass and it smells really nice. And it conditions their coat because... With your keys, they have really dry skin, just like me. Um, so it's good to a, not wash them too often, but use like something like a conditioning spray um, just to keep their coats healthy and shiny. And he also had his nails trimmed the other day. We took him to the groom room uh, because it would be really hard for us to trim him ourselves because his nails are really black, so it just wouldn't work and he gets crazy. So. We thought we'd take him to get it trimmed, but I'm going to give him a quick brush and I'm probably going to give him a, um, just his coat a trim soon as well at the groom room. So, yeah. Rambo, stop, stop. Rambo, sit, sit. Rambo, sit, 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 sit. Put, put your bum down. Good boy. Good boy. Stay, stay. Rambo. Rambo, what are you doing? Okay, you, you, you do that whilst mommy brushes you, yeah? Okay, no. What are we going to do with you, huh? What are we going to do with you? What are we going to do? Look, Rambo! Oh my goodness. So, that's it for this video, guys. That was my attempt at trying to brush my puppy alone. I don't know why I tried it, because I knew I wasn't going to get very far. As you can see, he just thinks I'm playing or he ends up biting me and I don't get very far brushing him. So I kind of need Amaya here to help me when doing that. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more sort of just me and Rambo videos, I guess, um, just things we get up to, then please comment below. I also want to do a our puppy picks our uh, day for us kind of video. So I think I'm going to film that tomorrow on Saturday. Also have some furniture coming tomorrow, so I might vlog that as well. Um, but yeah, if you enjoy this video, I hope you support the channel and can subscribe and also like. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you.